Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are back playing Rexara. So far, we are at test chamber 7. Okay. And, uh, so far it hasn't been too bad, but I have a feeling it's going to get a lot more difficult. Why is there a portal placement thing there? I guess that's just a hint that we should place our portal there. But, why would we want to do that? It says jump into the portal, but I don't really understand why, because that would just get us right back where we started. Alright, well, let's, uh... Let's see what's down there, I guess. This test chamber is meant to measure your mind's capacity for object persistence. In other words, this chamber will test your ability to understand that energy pellets exist even when you cannot see them. Get it... where? Oh, that portal has moved places now. Oh, okay, I see. This is cool music. Where do we even want to... That moved down. Interesting. what the point of that is. Am I missing something? How am I supposed to get to... over... there? Let's see what's up there. Maybe I'm missing something. Not... quite... Oh! How do I manage this, though? That's interesting. Can I switch this back? Can I get the orange portal to go back to where it used to be? Is that... a possibility? Yeah! It's a toggle! Huh. How do I want to go about doing this? Will this last indefinitely if the portals refresh it? It looks like... it will... Okay, so... We know it can handle that... I assume you can also handle this, right? Yeah, but... Then how would we actually get the portal to where we want it to go, is the question.
no, it, it wouldn't have- it doesn't even hit it, it expires before it hits it, so... How does it bounce if we do this? Not in any useful way. That was weird. I thought I saw that window disappear for a moment. Okay, I'm already stumped. <laughs> I know I have to switch this. But this one- this does not last indefinitely, so I don't have all the time in the world. Do I really have to do what I think I have to do? Run, 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 run. Ah. Let's try that one more time, shall we? Yeah! No idea... if that's what I'm supposed to do. But at least now I'm up here, right? Oh, I could- duh, I could just go up here first and then do the exact same thing I just did. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. So... What I did was pointless, but... Oh wait, I did that wrong. Let's try that one more time, please. Yeah, yeah! Okay. So now, we can actually get over there. Whoa! Forget how slowly it rotates. <laughs> now... Just do that, right? Yeah! You appear to understand that objects continue to exist even when they leave your field of vision. Great job. This encouragement core is really starting to get on my nerves. Interesting. Goodness, we have a lot of things going on here. Man, this ant line all over the place. You think you could have just put it down like this? I guess they wanted you to see it when you first walk in. Okay, where is our orange portal at? Up there. Okay, let's get a lay of the land then. There's an arrow. Oh my goodness. What's down there? Oh. We can't even go down there with without falling. Uh I don't think falling is going to end well for us, but I'm going to try it anyway. These 
To make this chamber pay off, you will need to get the energy pellet into the dispersal unit within 9.37 milliseconds. Good luck. 9.37 milliseconds, huh? Processing unit deactivated. That doesn't sound like a lot of time. Why do we have two of these things? What's the point of that? No, really, what is the point of that? Well, I guess I have to... I guess it has to go there, right? Hmm... Do we need to use the other one to free it? Cause... if... this can't... if we- if we shoot a portal here, it's just gonna go right back into the same prison again. Yeah, that's- that's not really doing any good for us. So maybe we can use another pellet to free it. I have to stand on this button just long enough to open the door. Yeah! This gas chamber took nine, 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 nine milliseconds to complete. Fantastic job. Yes, really fantastic work. I'm suitably impressed. Sarcasm processing unit deactivated. Alright, let's carefully fall down here. Alright then. Let's proceed! I don't remember hearing that electric zap before when objects disintegrated. It might be new. Goodness. <laughs> like the way the sparks fly off of stuff. Okay, so that's the goal. I'm just looking around. Why interesting. Looks like we don't have an orange portal yet, so... Not sure when we're gonna get that. Please take note ah. of the upgraded device on the intentionally out of reach platform. <laughs> you will need to obtain the upgraded device in order to proceed to the exit elevator. Yes, yes. We know. She needs to control two portals to related chambers. Ah, the gun shot the portal. Right, right. <laughs> Interesting. And the orange portal stays open because it's a different gun going through the Emancipation Grill. This is cool music.
green one. Okay. Hmm, yes. I do believe that he's not... a portal that we wanted to come out of. Wait... We don't want it to come out of any of the portals. Okay, now we can, uh... Yeah, okay. What happened to the green guy? here for now. Oh, right, but... Mm. So we don't actually want this here yet. Okay. Alright. Let's just get into cube, then. <laughs> that was weird. Where... do we want... this... to occur? Maybe we do want to shoot a portal in here. Ah yes, I think I've already messed up. I didn't know this game made a sound while you're holding an object. That's... I guess- I mean, I guess Portal 2 does, but it's just a more obvious sound. Come on, let me open this up. Alright then. I think we can actually make progress now, sort of. We can at least get the pellet to bounce where we want it to bounce, that's for sure. Let's just juggle it down there, how about- how about we... Wait, wait, wait... No, we gotta juggle it against the door. Okay. Well, let's go reclaim the cube, then. Oh, that's gonna disintegrate the cube, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so now she's gonna bounce against the door in the portal, right? Yeah, okay, cool. Cool! Now, let's actually figure out where we want to put it. Well, here's one place we can put it. But... why not... Oh, because the elevator's there. What's over here? Yeah, okay. For some reason I thought there was another thing over there, apparently not. Okay, so, we just want to get it over here, right? Oh, that scared me, I thought the game was earlier. crashing. You are not helping me restore power to the facility. Of course we have backup power for that. No, you are supplying the energy to something much more important. It will be a fun surprise. Mysterious surprise at 99.9950% activation energy. Now we can get our dual portal device. The 
handheld portable device has been modified to create Achievement unlocked. Rules. Keep this in mind as you continue to the next phase of testing. The achievement I got was intentionally out of reach. Alright then. Uh, let's get out of here. Let's abscond with this cube. Because I do believe that we need to go this way. Yes! <laughs> I am absconding with this cube, whether they like it or not. I never understand what the little... rings next to, uh... Like, what? Like, it just doesn't make any sense to me. So that shows you which portals you can place on the surface, but... What does the little O next to it mean? I've never understood that about Portal 1. Ah, uh, of course, I can't abscond with the cube anyway. Well, might as well quick save here. Yep, okay, that's what I thought. Cool! We now have a dual portal device. Well guys, thanks for watching. That's it for this episode, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye! Don't forget to leave a like, it's up to you.